Hey everyone and welcome to Dark Sun Gaming. My name is Chris and in today's video we are going to be talking about the confirmed information for the next EZA which is Ultimate Gohan. Now I do find that this is very interesting because Ultimate Gohan obviously is a Majin Buu Saga character yet for Golden Week we are going to have the Cell Games. So I think this right here is another pretty good indication that either one, the next JP celebration is going to be movie heroes, or this is just confirmation that we were supposed to have something with superheroes right now because it just seems too weird that this guy would get his easy A now. But any which way, I want to give a, a, a shout out. Oh, wait, hang on. Try to get this to go on. What's going on? All right. Um, a shout out to uh, Afro Kuma Gaming and Afro's News Guy. Um, they're the ones that had this information. I didn't see it anywhere else. Uh, not sure where they got it from, but uh, here's the information right here. So um, we've got the hybrid Saiyans. It's going to get a 170 across the board, category key plus three. And then super attack on his burst uh, limit or burst rush, excuse me, is now greatly raises attack and greatly raises defense for one turn. So infinitely stacks uh, attack and then raises defense for one turn and causes immense damage. Before he was just simply raises attack. So that is a huge improvement. And then a as far as his uh, passive is signs of brilliance, attack and defense plus 158 percent with super class allies, defense plus 50 percent, and trusted will category super class allies, key two and attack uh, plus 30 percent. I, I think there's going to be something interesting with that, which I'll talk about here in a moment. Um, high chance to guard against all attacks. Guard activated against all attacks for four turns and perform an additional attack that has a high chance of becoming a super attack when guard is activated. So um, once guard is activated, he is able to turn around and uh, really do a lot. So that's pretty good. Um, not to mention he is going to be able to have that hot uh Excuse me, he's going to have that additional attack with a 50% chance to super attack. So, very, very good with that. Um, my guess is he's going to probably pretty consistently do, like, I think starting out, he's going to be between four and four and a half million at a rainbow. And then with his greatly attacking, depending upon if you have full additional built onto him, he could probably get up pretty quick, uh, especially if you're able to get those. Uh, uh, things going on uh, with his additional attacks. Now, as far as his defense goes, I he's not getting a lot of defense, but he's getting guard. So you're you have to think, okay, even if he has um, you know anywhere between, uh, let's just use two hundred thousand for his defense. At, at two hundred thousand, that's almost very similar to him getting about a two hundred fifty thousand. In any event, that's going to be enough. Um, with some of the harder content, I think he'll take some damage. Um, I don't think it'll be devastating. Uh, I have not had a chance to play the new red zone, and that's the next new hard difficulty. That could be interesting. Now, the, the thing that I wanted to talk about, Entrusted Will. Okay, so these are all the um, Entrusted Will units that I have that are UR and LR. So if you take a look at some of these units, you got Gohan, you got MUI, Goku there. Uh, again, another Super Saiyan 2 Gohan. You got uh, God Trunks. Uh, you've got the uh, full power Super Saiyan 4 Goku. We've got Ultimate uh, Tech Gohan. Uh, so some of these units here, the reason why I find this interesting, these units kind of are a little bit of a hodgepodge, but I have a feeling we may end up seeing the new Dragon Ball Super Superhero units be something along the lines of a Entrusted Will plus 30 uh, 30%. 30 So basically, a, an Entrusted Will's 200% uh, team. Um, I, I just have this feeling about that because if, if that's the case, you're going to put an Ultimate Gohan, then, uh, which, where's he at here? Right here. Um, mine. So he's going to be at a 200%. And then another 30% plus 50% defense. Then it makes sense why they didn't give him like a lot more defense. Because that, that extra 60% defense, essentially, he's going to... At 200,000, you're talking about him probably almost hitting 
uh, you know, anywhere between 250 and 300,000 base plus guard, he'll be fine on that team. Um, the way I have my guy built, I actually have him on full crit, which is going to be a mistake right now. Um, he is probably needs to be full additional. And I, I did actually just recently, uh, get him at full, almost full link level 10. Um, I, I always stop at level nine. Like I have, when I have one unit that is at level nine, I'll run them through the rest of my stamina that run. Uh, but if they, it doesn't transform, I just skip it. I mean, I literally was wasting like multiple stones trying to get units to, to link level 10 and they just aren't going. And I'm like, I, I've got other units I could get link level 10 uh, for some of their links and the rest of them very, very high eights and nines uh, rather than, you know, spending three, four, five stones and not ever getting this last link. So I'm perfectly fine with that uh, rant over there. But otherwise, that's pretty much it. That's all I want to talk about today with the Ultimate Gohan. Um, if you haven't done so already, please make sure you go down, hit that red subscribe button, and don't forget that notification bell so you're notified each and every time that I'm uploading a new video. But otherwise, that's going to be it. That's going to be today's video. Thank you all very much for watching. We'll talk to you guys later.